everybody so today I'm going to show you guys how I created the snake through eye look I'm going to be putting everything I use down in the description below so I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started okay so the first thing I'm going to do is take some masking tape and cover up my eye with it make sure when applying the tape that your eye is completely covered because we are going to be putting latex over this and we don't want that getting into the eye okay so now that i have my eye all covered up i'm going to take my liquid latex and i'm going to apply a thin layer over my eye and that way when i apply the scar wax after it's easier for it to stick So I'm just applying a thin layer here, making sure not to get any latex on my eyebrows because it's really, really hard to take off if you do. Okay, so now that the latex is nice and dry, I'm going to take my stretchy snake I got at Spirit. And I'm going to cut it in half about right here. Okay, so now that I have my snake all cut out and I figured out exactly where I want it, I'm going to take some red face paint and trace the end of the snake onto my eye. That way I have an outline of where the snake's gonna be going through. Okay, so now I'm gonna take my Ben Nine Nose and Scar Wax. I'm going to take about this much and I'm going to shape it into a strip like this, kind of just outline the circle I just drew. Make sure you have enough wax to go around your outline. If not, just stretch it out like I'm doing here or just add a little bit more wax. Now that I'm happy with my outline, I'm going to start pressing lightly onto the wax. That way it sticks onto the latex. Okay, so now I'm going to take a little bit of Vaseline and kind of just press down on the wax. That way it sticks better. Okay. So now that the wax is nice and stuck, I'm going to take some more Vaseline and smooth out the edges. Try smoothing it out as much as possible, that way it looks more like part of the skin and it makes it look more realistic. I didn't really like how the tape was sticking out here, so I decided to cut it off with some scissors.
then I took a little bit more wax and just smoothed it out onto my skin, making sure not to get any on my eyebrow. It's very important to always use Vaseline while smoothing out the wax. That way it doesn't stick onto your fingers and it makes the process way easier. Okay, now I'm going to take a clean makeup sponge and dab around the wax. That way the shine from the Vaseline will go away. Now that that is all done, I'm going to take my spatula and open up the hole more. Okay, so now that I'm basically done opening up the hole, I'm going to take the end of my snake and just kind of check if it fits inside. Yes, okay. So now I'm just going to take some liquid latex and apply a thin layer over the wax, that way the wax stays in place. Okay, so now that the wax is basically dry, I'm going to take my Cinema Secrets Injury Stack. You could basically get this anywhere, like Party City or Spirit, it's pretty cheap. And I'm going to take this um, purple shade on the bottom, and I'm going to outline um, inside the hole, just to make it appear a little bit deeper. Okay, so now that I'm all done with that, I'm going to take the end of my snake again and I'm going to apply some liquid latex to the end of it, that way it'll stick onto my eye. Okay, so the latex isn't quite dry yet, but it feels pretty much stuck. Okay, so I'm just going to take a little bit of latex on my finger and apply it to the snake. And just stick it to my forehead. I 
and just wait for that to dry. Okay, so now that that's stuck, I'm going to use the same purple I used in the beginning. And then I'm going to outline around the snake again. Okay, so now that I'm done with that, I'm going to take the same Cinema Secrets Injury Stack that I used in the beginning, but this time I'm going to use this red shade. And I'm also going to kind of just outline around the snake again. Okay, so I'm also going to take the same red shade and kind of just put a little bit around where the hole starts. Kind of just blend it in with the makeup sponge. Okay, so I'm going to go around here with some red. Then I'm going to take the purple I used in the beginning as well and just kind of dab it on my fingers and then create some bruising under the eye. And then around the eye as well. Okay, so now I'm going to take some Cinema Secrets Blood Gel and with a Q-tip, I'm going to dab it around where the snake goes in the eye. So now I'm just going to take some more blood gel and kind of just make it drip down the eye. Okay, so I'm pretty much done applying the blood gel. All I really need to do is just stick the other end into my mouth. So. Alright guys, well that pretty much sums up the video. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, I'm going to be posting more videos like this throughout um, this whole month all the way till Halloween. So subscribe. And if you guys want to follow me on my social medias, this is my Instagram. And this is my Twitter. So follow me if you'd like. And thank you.
Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.